Hello, today we will be unboxing slash unwrapping, whatever you would like to call it, Batman Mask of the Phantasm on 4K Ultra HD plus uh, digital code. Um, this comes as part of the uh, complete collection, which is uh, this right here on Blu-ray, but I saw that it was on sale on uh, 4K and I'm like, this is such a great Batman movie, I definitely have to upgrade it. So I decided to upgrade it and this isn't going to be a review of how the transfer is and all that, this is simply going to be an unboxing. So anyway, without further ado, shall we begin? So to start off, here's the cover of it. As you can see, it says 4K Ultra HD plus digital code, Batman Mask of the Phantasm. Got the uh, DC logo right there. Then we got uh, Batman on the cover, the Phantasm, um, Andrea, and uh, the Joker, and just him running on top of a rooftop. I absolutely love this image. It's just great. Then if we take a look at the spine of it, that's what the spine looks like. Very um, simplistic, which is nice. Same for that one. Then if we take a look at the back, this is what it says. DC Animated Movies, A New Era of Adventure. The Dark Knight must save Gotham City from a new threat. Then the, blah, blah. That's what it's about. If anybody would like to pause it and read it. And then uh, the special features that it comes with is Kevin Conroy, I Am the Knight. And then if we scroll down a little bit more, it's rated PG for animated violence and it runs at 76 minutes long. Now, I feel like mostly everybody will know this, but I'll tell it anyway. This movie did go to theaters. They just did little to no advertising for it that it completely bombed. But it is cool knowing that there was an animated Batman movie that went to theaters. But anyway, let's get out of its packaging, shall we? So I'll take the slip cover off. Do a quick side by side. Get the plastic wrap off. There we go. Well, starting to get it open. Shouldn't say that it's off yet. There we go. Pretty much got it all. Sometimes it likes to stick to the spine, which is a tad bit annoying. But anyway, down the garbage disposal it goes. Beautiful. Then we gotta open it to hear that snap. There we go. And now I will flip the camera around so you can see what I see. So once you open it, this is what you're greeted with. Sadly, it doesn't really come with any artwork whatsoever, but as you can see, it just says Batman Mask of the Phantasm, 4K Ultra HD, HDR, and then uh, you got the DC logo and the WB logo, but if you want to look at what it looks like uh, without a slip cover, that's what it looks like. We'll take a quick look at the back as well. But um, if you haven't seen this movie, I highly recommend giving it a watch. It is arguably one of the best Batman movies ever made, and it is such such a good time. But anyway, as you could see, that is Batman Mask of the Phantasm on 4K Ultra HD. So if you enjoyed this video, please give it a like and a subscribe so I know to keep making more of these. If you have any video requests, please leave them down in the comments below. I'll do my best to reply. As of now, I have a few video requests and those are being made. But if you do have any others, just let me know as long as within my capability of making it, I will be making it. And if you own Batman Mask of the Phantasm on 4K Ultra HD, uh, let me know if you do down in the comments below or if you're just happy with the Blu-ray. And honestly, once I do give this a watch, I'll probably do a review video for it just to let you know how the 4K transfer looks because I own um, Batman. Batman, Batman Returns, Batman and Robin, and Batman, uh, Batman Forever, then Batman and Robin on 4K, and all those look absolutely fantastic. Um, for modern, I gotta say, Aquaman looks absolutely fantastic on 4K as well, but sadly, Birds of Prey, uh, did not look that great on 4K, but, um, this is just simply, uh, simply, uh, something else to add to my Batman collection, because if you follow this channel, you know I'm a complete Batman nerd, and I will be, I will keep on collecting everything Batman related, but anyway, thanks for watching as always, and I'll see all of you in the next video. Bye!